Where are your privacy rights and where are mine? What do you have the right to privacy to in your life and in your mind? What are my privacy rights and in the same turn or in kind? And what I'm asking you is do you understand the language that I'm speaking to you or are you off in your mind? You see, people don't always get the best understanding of alliteration, but people also don't understand the laws across our nation. When I'm talking like this, I'm trying to get you to pay attention to this, but when I do this, you get in a way that you want to dismiss it. But what I'm talking about to you today is privacy rights. Privacy rights apply to many things in many areas in our life. Privacy first begins when we wake up in the morning. Those privacy rights are considerably there. What are those privacy rights if you do and if you care? What I'm saying to you is what are our privacy rights the minute we wake up? The minute we wake up, we have the privacy rights to pray. The minute we wake up, we have the privacy rights to get ready our body for the day without someone voyeuring in through our, our home or peeping Tom us through a window. What I'm asking you is do you take care of your computer and its video on your screen? Because sometimes someone can be on the other side taking a look through that screen. Now what I'm talking about is privacy rights, but privacy rights apply to our banking. Privacy rights apply to our finances. Privacy rights apply to our paycheck level and the costing of our life, the expenditures that we make, the consumer rights that we take in terms of what we buy and what we don't. We also have privacy rights with regard to our medical practices and our medical service providers. No one has the right to know those things. We also have privacy rights to our benefit packages with our employer we have privacy rights with regard to our legalities and things that we've done right and done wrong in our life. 